there's also taking something out of Article 7A, existing as far as the ultimate consumer, the objections being. So that's a f part of the phrase we're going to take out from Article 7. Thank you, Mr. Engström. I would like to protest very, very strongly ag against uh, these so-called compromise amendments. My office received them yesterday at 10 o'clock in the evening. This is simply no way uh, to, to work. I have not been consulted uh, at all on this. So these are not, in my opinion, these are not compromise amendments. These are new amendments tabled by Ms. Mrs. Castex after the deadline for amendments. They do not follow the rules for compromise amendments. I, in particular, have not even been asked. And still I see my name on, on three of these amendments. These are Amendment 2, Amendment 4, Amendment 7. I most strongly do not endorse those compromises, and I have never been asked about it. So this is completely in breach of every single procedure rule there is. Amen for Amendment 2, by, by me, Wikström and, and, and Geringer. We discussed it, in the, the, that one we discussed in the December, and I said clearly no, and yet it's being tabled here as if it were a compromise that I was supporting. I must really strongly object. So I don't, I would want to, to have all these uh, so-called compromise amendments uh, seen as inadmissible, because they're not compromise amendments, that, that means they're tabled after the deadline, they, they should not be uh, admissible. In particular, a compromise Amendment 2, 4 and 7, where I see my name against my own will. And uh, while I, the same thing, I mean, these oral amendments, they come too, too late. So I, I protest against all the oral amendments, each of them, uh, as a matter of principle, because I do not think that this is the way we should be legislating in this committee. Thank you. Frau Kollegin Wikström, bitte. Madam Wikström, please. And, well, I support everything that my colleague has just underlined, and I also understand that he's a bit upset. I'm also upset, but, you know, some are pirates, some are, you know, more typical Swedish low boys. <laughs> so I feel that I need to make a clarification about the votes that we're just about to have on this dossier. I would like to underline...